Hello YouTube and welcome to more historic brawl content. If you like the content, like the content. And subscribe. <laughs> anyway, today we're playing, uh, I don't know if this is how they intend it to be pronounced, but I'm pronouncing it Jan Janssen Chaos Crafter. Uh, he is black white, black white in a red for a 3-3 gnome artificer with haste has two abilities tap sacrifice an artifact creature create two treasure tokens or tap sacrifice a non-creature artifact create two one one colors construct artifact creature tokens so turns your non-creatures into creatures turns your creatures into into treasure um so this deck is a sacrifice theme deck with artifact sub theme and we're playing all the usual suspects and some of the unusual ones because that's kind of what the theme dictates. This actually took me like two days to put together because I, I built it, I wasn't happy, I rebuilt it, and then I tweaked it some. It's interesting. Any thoughts with Revel and Riches and making an infinite combo? I don't think that makes the infinite combo you think it makes. I think Revel and Riches is expensive and doesn't do enough. Uh, so quickly going over what we have. We have Mayhem Devil because we're sacrificing stuff. Bank Job because it's a good card. We have some big dumb things up here at the top. We have no Planeswalkers in our deck because the Immortal Sun is going to be our main target for reanimation. Our reanimation includes Refurbish, Trash for Treasure. I'm sure there are other things that I'm just forgetting. Untap, make treasures, sack. How are we untapping? That That's the question I have. You say infinite combo, so I feel like there's something in here that I'm missing where sacking artifacts untaps Jan Janssen. That, that's the part I'm, I'm not understanding, I guess. Uh, let's see. So, yeah. We're just going to go ahead and sacrifice things, make make some treasure, make some enemies. The game, oh my god, the game already needs a restart. All right, we were at 45 minutes the last time we needed a restart. Now we're at an hour 12. That's, that's basically 45 minutes, right? I don't know how math works. 90 minutes, so no, it's half an hour. Diminishing returns. Uh, so confused. I agree that it feels like there should be a combo, but I did not see one in my two days worth of research. There's probably one in like Commander proper. Oh god, I've read this card so many times and I still don't know what it does. Tap, sacrifice up to three target permanent or three permanents. If there were three or more card types above the sacrifice, each boat lose three life, you gain three life and draw three cards. Okay. Uh <laughs> Yeah, yeah, exactly. Exactly. I'm just gonna frame all again. Awkward. But I'm gonna keep. Oh, I, I I like this commander too. I was just way too out of it to even start to think about how to build it. Ant block must attack. I don't... 
Uh, maybe I was supposed to play Ravenous Intruder. I just need artifacts. If I get a land, I'll be very happy because I'll have Karn here. I want a Nicker Wellspring. Why not me? <laughs> I want a Cold Steel Heart. <laughs> Hello? I can't have it, you can't have it. They're the witch, but we have the familiar. <laughs> True. Yeah, the animation on Rip Apart actually confused me. Hey, land. I battle for the if I minus this, I make a 1-1. One, one. I think I'm just going to plus for now. Good choice. Ooh, finally. Good news. It is weird, because it, like, hesitates, right? I thought the sound was broken already, because it, like... It does this little up thing and there's no noise and then it makes a sound as it's hitting. Gave me Cold Steel Heart. I'm so happy. It's best if you stop. Best if you stop. We have five manas. Um Was it on your house? Who am I kidding it was? Uh, so if I do this, right? I make this. Evil cannot withstand a righteous I can do this and I'll have four mana, but... Huh. Doesn't matter. I think I'm just gonna sacrifice it right now. Sacrifice a non-creature artifact. I'm just gonna make large lads here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, I think we're going to Sculpting Steel our, our Karnstruct. Then, uh... Yeah. Let's plus first. A curious choice. I feel like they tried really hard to to keep um, keep green mana up here to protect this. So if I play this, I have two mana. Well, actually, I have four mana after that. All right. All right, here we go. That's neat. Then I can sacrifice a creature. Oh, I have six mana. Holy crap. Crap. Uh, uh, 
Oh, I goofed. Still wanted to kill this. Eh, it doesn't matter, actually. We're going to sacrifice Gutter Bones, Icar Wellspring, and Treacherous Blessing. That's three different types. We lose three life, they gain three life, they draw three cards. Neat. This is a really thinky match, huh? Circuit Mender is the card that I'm missing. I have uh, Filigree Familiar in here. Circuit Mender's technically better, but Filigree Familiar is cuter. So, you know. Like this is a beetle bug, and Filigree Familiar is a cute little foxy. <laughs> This is how normal people talk, right? Get rid of the cat, not really doing anything on this board. Civic's good. Still like my Civic. do that. It's so good, right? Because one, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. This. Another Karnstruct. Uh, hit them for 12 first. And yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. Even get to keep a treasure. Oh, right. Do six to both. Sure. Uh, I think if I remember Forgotten Monument, it's too cute. It's not Forgotten Monument. Ah, oh, you did this last time. How did you open it? Gotten uh, uh Forsaken Monument? Yeah, uh no. I don't think we really need it. Ugin might be interesting, but it doesn't make artifacts. It makes colorless spells cheaper though. Hmm. Hmm. I love the back and forth with this card. I love just being like, all right, so I tap this, I sacrifice this treasure, I make two one ones. These are all six sixes. And then I attack, uh, and then next turn, I sacrifice one of the one ones, I have two extra mana, I can do something silly. I, I don't know that we have the details right just yet, but this deck is grindy. Grinder. Oh, 
Oh no, they put us against five color stuff. Uh, and we all, uh, our hands all three drops. Uh, awkward. Uh, uh, sure. Why not? I might just cut Cat Oven for like two actually playable cards and a hundred card singleton. I am not lucky enough for it. Now the question is, do I play this tapped or untapped so that I can deadly dispute? I'm just gonna play it. Oh, if I played it untapped, I could deadly dispute and then Jan Janssen into some one ones. Fair. I thought they were about to counterspell me. I was like, wait a minute. Got gold span dragon next turn. Gold span dragon gives us some fodder for Jan Janssen. We also have Icker Wellspring. God, Deadly Dispute plus Gold Span Dragon used to be pretty busted, huh? Killed my cat. I really don't care. business okay okay they took our good dragon boy but we have only called anvil 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 also have that Feels grindier though. Oh my god. Oh, that's obnoxiously good, huh? It's pretty good. I 
as when they wrath me, right? Hmm, this is the... No? The Golgari destroy a bunch of things spell? Yeah. My army, it grows. Until the sweeper. At least with the sweeper, I have Den of the Bugbear. Mm. How much do I care? One short? Uh, uh. We'll get there, we'll get there. You got Mayhem Devil. Mayhem Devil, the oven, lightning bolt. Life, they're at six. Ugh. May have died. Understood this. I want to exile this, auto pay, sacrifice this, take action. Permanent. So I want to hold on to this. Ass? Now their targets aren't very good? Mm, they took a land. That's fine-ish. Sure. Why not? <laughs> Boop. Oh, I don't have an artifact for Spired Industry anymore. Oh, I didn't change the title. Oh, no. Title is generic and perfect. Lovely. Missed a point of damage somewhere. Probably making more one ones than. Uh, probably making more one ones than I was making than I was attacking with the commander. Like if we get one hit in with the commander instead of making two one ones, you're dead. Exactly. So yeah. Okay. I thought the game was going a little bit longer than it was. 
I was right, but for all the wrong reasons. <laughs> Badrock. Oh, it's just a different skin than I recognize. Different way that it looks. Art. Art is one way to describe it. Uh, all right. This. Play the egg. Draw a card. Hmm. Dead action. Okay. Wrath of God. Reading Wrathed. Back to the command zone with you. Back to the command zone with you. It's kind of funny how we haven't really gotten to do the aristocrats part of this deck. By funny, I mean sad. There's the witch's oven. Can't help but notice they're stuck on four. Oh, never. Oh, I know what they drew for the turn. God, that looks really bad to me. <laughs> this, the the square version of it. But will I see it coming? does beg the question. Oh, I should have played Witches of it. Glad I didn't play the Witch's Oven. And I wanted to keep the treasure around. So let's go ahead. 
Stock this in. Play this. Him to play our commander for the millionth time. Succeed. Rock card. <laughs> This is a joke card. We could probably replace this with something that's actually good. But it turns all our creatures into artifacts for, for further artifact shenanigans. I can technically just cast this this turn. Uh, sure, why not? Yellow, yellow swing. I like how the music is like getting bigger and bigger as we're doing sillier and sillier things. Ah, oh, we've made treasure. Let's do this now. <laughs> Blue. Drawing so many cards. Woo. Woo. I do declare. gonna abrade this but I really hamstrung them for mana now right they're at six life I spell with targets. <laughs> nice spell with targets. Uh, yeah. Did it. Joda, <laughs> I drew this guy today. Uh, it's gonna be a yikes. I guess this hand is fine. Kind of sucks that we have to use our spell land as land. card <laughs> Two man and draw a card Ooh. 
seek to co oh, okay they just got more draws um oh that makes me sad actually i don't have white mana so i'm just gonna make this friend back to three this friend makes white mana Two one ones draw a card, deal one to you. Oh, heck yeah. Then we come here and we get our biggest, dumbest artifact. Probably God Pharaoh statue, honestly. Got refurbish in hand. Er, take another turn. And... Oh, I don't have a white source! Er! Frustrating. White source was the token they bounced. Okay. Yeah. Oh, they have three, sure. This card to. Furbish, God Pharaoh statue, auto pay. Job into play. They go. Even if they bounce God Pharaoh statue, I can just recast it while destroying their Teferi. Seems to be him. We will meet again. Nagate! Okay. Did I just gone for the kill? Four, five, six? I could have killed them? I should have just gone for the gold span dragon kill.
Pushing it. Okay, um, let's see. I put them to one. Oh, I can't put them to one because they have this. Oh, no, no, no. I have... And the sound's gone again. Gosh, bank job. So good in this deck. Langouche. Do you have three mana problem? So let's see one, two, three, four, four, and then one, two, threes. Waiting for me to tap into the bugbear. Hey, this works. Goes there, I get another token. I mean, they've drawn so many cards, there's a chance. I could also just bottom Liliana because I have swords. Instant sorcery or artifact. Magma Opus, Rivers Rebuke, Time Warp, Solve. And they get an extra turn as well. Yeah, it's basically dead. So, yeah, if I bottom Omniscience, they get an extra turn. They get, they get two extra turns. If I bottom the big thing, they get Omniscience, and they've been drawing a million cards. If I bottom the extra, yeah, there's no good choice there. Pictionary. All right. Uh... <laughs> All right. Let's see what Scryfall has for you. I recognize that card, but... Uh. All 
All right. This is a relatively recent one, so we'll do this one. Um, all right, so you've got... <laughs> as seems to be the theme today, I am making a circle. Seems to be the theme today. We have a man. Man has eyes. Those eyes were very poorly done, and his nose is this way. And he's got himself a beard. Black beard, so appropriate that I am wearing, or wearing, using the correct color. <laughs> wearing. Uh, his hair goes this way, this way, standing. Alright. Uh, he's got like this weird neck piece here. Um, very big shoulder. This arm, very buff, going this way. This arm, going this way, also very buff. Him, just buff. He's holding up a giant axe. So let's get some fingies in here. It's Marty. Eh, I'm not that bearded, at least. My hair isn't black, it's brown. This axe, uh, I want to redo. First, let's make the staff for the axe. And then, this axe is kind of interesting. It comes up like this, like out, like here, and then just like back down again, kind of like that, right? Uh, he's muscle, muscle man. And he's strapping himself in. He's uh, obeying the law and wearing a seatbelt, even though he doesn't appear to be in a car, which is actually relevant in magic. Oh, God. Uh, he's got, like, a championship WWE belt, but bigger. Um... <laughs> no. It's got, like, a design. I've made it way too large, just for the record thing here and then his body comes back this way and it's like actually a belt like that and he's wearing a, I want to say skirt but technically a skirt this comes like this and there's like this band coming this way then a band going this way uh, this arm comes down into fist. Blah, I will punch. It is in Kaldheim, you are correct. Uh Rally the Ant or Rally the Rex. I'll give you that. I, I knew what you meant. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> uh when I put them side by side. <laughs> Uh, all right. I kept thinking I see this card all the time, but couldn't figure out. <laughs> uh. Oh, hey, we're playing against dragons. I'm going to keep and believe in the heart of the cards. Dragons. God. Dragon. Sure. Records matter, folks. We <laughs> take those. Uh... I think this deck is cool so far. I don't. I still don't know if it's good, but is this the same person? It's the same. It's the same commander at the very least. 
but uh, I think it does some interesting things. Play this, play this, draw a card. Then next turn we get to play Sanguine Breaststroke and then start draining while making, while ramping. Wait, we're gonna be able to play Sanguine Breaststroke, sacrifice this. And then play Karn. This deck is sweet. No! I needed that! <laughs> uh, I needed that. Why are you so mean, opponent? I'm gonna shock this in because I. Wait, I still no. That's a blood. Never mind. That's a blood. Okay. And the planner were errors. So fearsome. I'm gonna go ahead, ditch this to draw a card. Mayhem Devil. Woohoo! Woohoo! Ooh, interesting. Interesting. All right. Uh, how much mana do we have this turn? We have five lands and four treasures, so that's nine. And we start here. Memory laps me, huh? All right, uh, if I sacrifice this, I have five mana. Mm -hmm. Not quite there. So I'm gonna do it. Oh wait, hit the wrong button. Want more treasures. More treasures, please. Gosh, then Prismari commanding away that one artifact really set me behind here. Ow. Agrimauling or land. So, as always, Karn draws a land. land 
Maybe I wasn't supposed to do that because now this is awkward. Ugh. Or mana draw land. Hmm. I love the lack of half of the sounds here. We're losing Karn to Miram. Their deck is cooler than ours was. Sure. Oh, this only triggers once? No. It's just taking a moment. Got it. Arn is dead. But is he gone? have and goat. Just loop them back and forth. I was supposed to put this on red. Eh, it doesn't matter. Have this as well. All right. Okay. Oh, it makes the adventure side cheaper too. We didn't get to see that. Because uh, we never drew anything. It's so weird having just the music and then occasionally there's a sound effect. I don't have a wrath in this deck, I don't think. I need to find a way not just die, slash to kill them. Give me the goat. Like, ah, yes. Something to remove their scariest threat. Bottom mat, please. I wish I had a blood artist, but for artifacts. And I'm dead, right? I block six, I take a lot more. All right, uh, I think I'm gonna call it for that one. I I feel like I feel like it's on the precipice of being something, but I'm not used to building these style decks, so I, I don't know what to inject. I kind of wasn't impressed with these two cards, so I cut those to to figure out what cards you need. We we need some sort of wrath. Literal Wrath is probably fine. Uh, you gain life equal to the number of creatures you controlled that were destroyed this way. Also probably fine, honestly. Put two Wraths in. Oh, wait. No, 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 hold on. 
There we go, Kyle. I got there in the end. Figured it out. Um... Man, it just did so many cool things and then just lost. <laughs> There's a chance you could put... Doom Foretold in here, but a lot of the stuff we make are to tokens. Yeah, and it specifies non-token. I guess eventually you just sacrifice Doom Foretold, but... I don't know. The, the refurbished plan was pretty good. It's pretty light on white mana. Well, probably fine on white mana. We were just... We didn't have white mana that game. Or we, we had the refurbish, and then they kept bouncing our stuff, and I could have attacked with Jan Janssen. Anyway, I like the deck. I don't think it's good, but I really, really like what it's doing. <laughs> uh, enjoy, I guess. <laughs>